Hey guys, uh, so I wanted to uh, get back on here and show you some updates. I, it's been a while since I've uh, put anything up, so I wanted to show you some of the finished product, uh, projects that we've done, uh, in particular this bathroom project. Um, so we started out, um, if you watch the videos, we went and you know painted the bathroom vanity, uh, we painted the walls, uh, we did the paint on the, the light fixture and uh, so we'll go ahead and show you some of those things. Uh, first we'll start with the vanity. Um, this is, you know, it was an oak vanity and I showed you in the first uh, four parts on how to uh, paint that and what we did, we went from a sort of honey oak to we used um, Sherman Williams All Surface Enamel in Gauntlet Gray and it's a satin finish if you can see i mean it turned out really nice um only sort of caution i would say i guess or something to look for when you when i, I use satin on this which i love the finish it's uh very soft smooth and but in a bathroom um you know the dark color in the satin is going to show some fingerprints from you know like if you've been using powder or makeup and different things like that uh, but it, it's wipeable. It's very durable. It's super hard right now. So I mean, you know, a little distilled water, an alcohol mix, and you can wipe it right down, um, and, and it's no problem. So I mean, you know, big time change in look right there. Uh, the other project that uh, I showed you was the vanity light. So this was a brass vanity light that had some sort of frosted globes on it and you know I used the um, Rust-Oleum it was the hammered um, spray in nickel and then on top of that I used the Rust-Oleum uh, chrome um, and that's in the other video on how to do that and then we added some new globes uh, that we got for a really good deal at Lowe's for like $11 a piece so, you know, for, I don't know, you know, 40, 45 maybe dollars, something like that, we basically changed the whole look of that. And uh, so that saved us quite a bit of money. Uh, we went with a sort of framed mirror look. I, I did not paint that, believe it or not. And uh, bought that at, I'm not sure where we got it. It might have been Steinmart or, um, maybe Marshall's, not sure. Uh, it was a good price and we took out the, we had just sort of a, you know, wall mirror, took that off and just put this in for a more sort of, you know, clean look. Uh, and then we did the walls and the walls are in uh, repose gray, uh, also Sherman Williams. And we went through a couple tips on how to do that. And it's a nice uh, neutral gray borders on a little bit warm of a gray uh, but you can kind of balance that out with uh, we, we added some new accessories um, in blue and silver and that sort of you know cools it down a little bit uh, so if you if you factor out sort of the, the new accessories um, which you know we, we didn't spend a ton of money on those either but the paint the paint project the light project um, you know, less than $200 and, and that included the cabinets. So, I mean, we basically changed the whole look of the bathroom, uh, for a couple hundred dollars and tied, you know, some accessories on top of that. And, uh, but, uh, it turned out really well. We're, we're happy with it. And, uh, so we'll do some more updates later. Thanks.